Hello and welcome to the channel again. Pen friends everywhere, thank you for tuning in. It's time to have another collection update and for this update I would like to say that it's all about blue pens. Let's start first with the pen that's going to leave the collection and that one is my Stipula Etruria Rainbow. I've owned this piece for the last one year or so. I've enjoyed it as much as I could. It doesn't have any problems. It writes perfect. It's equipped with a 14 karat flex fine nib and Stipula calls them Stiflex nibs. I've made a lot of content with this pen, I've made pictures to it and I believe it's time to let the next owner enjoy it as much as I did. So this is the pen that's going to be removed from the collection and passed on to the next owner. And now it's time to tackle the piece that's going to be added to the collection. And I'd like to start first saying that having this pen was not possible if I was not friends with Ciro Matrone, the former co-founder of the Delta Pen Company. I've jumped to the occasion after Ciro told me that it is willing enough to pass one to me such a beautiful piece and uh, although I don't have so many informations regarding the name of the pen, um, aspects, details, model and anything like this, I've jumped to the occasion just because it has a material that I've been missing in my collection and that one is the blue Mediterranean celluloid which Leonardo was using on the, the first two models of the Momento Zero Limited Edition. It was the butterfly celluloid, which they call it uh, Blue Abyss. And there was one more Mediterranean blue, which is this beautiful turquoise color. And I said to Chiro, I want this pen if you are willing to pass it on to me. So this is the pen right here. It's a beautiful example of what an amazing writing instrument can be. It's made out of celluloid, it has silver trims, it's equipped with a huge size 8 nib, gold nib, medium point, ebonite feed, it writes wet, it has a hint of feedback which I do love more and more when it comes to writing experiences. It's equipped with a capture converter, I believe. Huge ink capacity. I think it was a limited edition, but I don't have any details regarding that. But we will have all of the details and informations ready for when we are going to review this pen on the PenVenture YouTube channel. I think this is it. If you want to be updated with uh, my collection, you can hit the subscribe button on my YouTube channel, turn the notification bell on, and also drop a like on this video. It will help us with the algorithm to have our content reach out to many more just like you. Also, Remember, if you are looking for a next writing instrument, ink or paper, visit my website. Down below you will find links for the website and also for all of my social media accounts. My name is Emmy and I look forward to seeing you next video.